hey hello welcome to my channel you are here because you want to see the giant of the world i mean the tallest humans on planet earth but before i do that can i ask you a question have you subscribed to my channel yet if not do me a favor subscribe and be part of this great family on youtube do i have to beg you to like the video too please do me a favor and like the video my name is Watermeyer and I've always been obsessed with tall people. Sometimes I wonder what it takes to be tall. On a very stupid day in my life, I can goggle how to be tall. Because I'm not just an annoying village YouTuber, but also very, very short. I mean, extremely short. During my research on how to be tall, I found out that the world's tallest humans are found in South Sudan. I quickly jumped on the plane and landed in Juba, South Sudan. When I got here, I realized that indeed, South Sudan is the land of slim, dark, and tall. And all I wanted to know is their secret. Hey, no! Wow, see. You and Mundari, you drink the milk and you still can't be like you. How can I be like you, man? Yeah, if you want to be like me. What do I do? You have to pay 100 cows. Eh? You have to pay 200 cows. Ah. <laughs> Cows to and, be like you. and you, like you, you take 20 liters full of milk. <laughs> <laughs> Let me assure you, you'll grow tall like me. Okay, you know what? I know there's a cattle camp in here. Uh -huh. I'm just gonna go there, uh -huh. buy 200 cows, uh -huh. drink a lot of milk, uh -huh. and I'll come back again. I assure you, you'll grow tall like me. Uh, you sure I'm gonna grow tall like you? You grow tall like me. <laughs> <laughs> when he told me the acid crate, the next day I found myself in the biggest cattle camp I've ever seen in my entire life, and what I was looking for was fresh milk. I drink milk, will I be able to be tall like him? What is it? No, it can't happen. It can't happen. But they told me that I need to drink milk to become tall. That you'll never grow tall. Ah! That you're already old. Ah! So I, I should have started drinking this when I was a kid, right? It's fresh milk, man. <laughs> I literally enjoyed my fresh milk, thinking that the next day I will be a giant too. But I never became tall, but rather ended up in the toilet. Oh, oh no! Yalas. Hey, what am I? What happened? Oh my God! You didn't grow taller. I didn't, they told me to drink all the fresh milk, uh -huh. but I rather ended up in the toilet. So sorry. Jeez. I think it has something to do with some genes as well. You can't really. These guys began drinking milk since they were born. I think you're late. I'm late. You're too late. You missed the. Yalas. Why are so many people tall in this country? Um, milk, but genetics. <laughs> <laughs> genetics is the main reason I, I, why. I'm glad you said genetics. Genetics. Can you tell me some of the most famous tallest people that has ever come out from this country? Have you ever heard of the late Monut Ball? Oh, yeah. He was the tallest basketball player in the world. He played for the NBA and he was from here, South Sudan. From South Sudan? South Sudan, from the Nile. Which means that you guys need to have the best basketball team in the world. I believe we do. We believe We're all we the do. top people that you got yes. in this country? Yes. And then we are up there. Uh, get me, I'll be the next basketball player, man. <laughs> <laughs> Have you also heard of Luol Deng? Luol Deng? Yeah. He's, uh, he played for the Chicago Bulls. Oh, okay. Yeah, in the USA. And now he's actually really current. He keeps coming to South Sudan to uh, work on the Manut Ball Foundation. It's an academy for basketball players. So we're raising more. I'm glad that they are so all beat everyone. Back. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but tell um, the president that I, I'm one of the basketball players. Since I've drunk a lot of milk, give me two years. Yeah. I'll be tall. Let's I'll give me time. After Let's give years. me time. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> He's the tallest from home. Yeah. Ah. In Ghana. Nah, uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> so he's the tallest guy in Ghana? <laughs> no, no, no. Thought, hey, no, okay, maybe, maybe. Come, come closer. Uh. Ah, but I, I mean, I feel like... Okay. Ha! Huh. Jeez. <laughs> you see? The word, tallest guy in Ghana. Uh, no, in, in Ghana, I, I'm tall, man. I, oh, I'm really? I'm tall in Ghana. Really? Wow. <laughs> come, Mandela, come. <laughs> Mandela, come. 
Are, are you from South Sudan? I'm from South Sudan, yeah. You don't, you don't feel intimidated? The, 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 see. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> Mandela, how, how do you feel knowing that in your country people are taller than you? No, I feel good because the people there, the people is uh, just from the tribe. The okay. tribe is different tribe, but okay. we are one people. Different tribe, one people. one people. I love that. So, which tribe are you? I'm proudly Dinka. Dinka? Yeah. So, it's like the Dinka people are the tallest? Yeah, Dinka are the tallest people. There are a lot of tall people. The Dinka, the Nwer, the Shuluk. But I want to see the Dinkas a bit taller than the rest of the tribes. Wow. So, it depends on the tribe that you're from. Which tribe are you? I'm, tri I'm from Ye. Your tribe, they don't grow tall, eh? No. I guess I want to join your tribe, man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what what is the advantage of being tall, man? What yeah. is the advantage do you have for being tall? Yeah, as being tall, there are a lot of advantages, you know. Oh, tell me some of the advantages. Some of the advantages, you know, you can become a basketballer. Okay. Yeah, you know, in the world nowadays, South Sudan is still the youngest. Okay. But in the near future, we can still join the NBA and become some of the famous NBA players in the world. But do you play basketball? I mean, I don't play basketball. I lose playing basketball some three years back. Oh, okay. Yeah. So what do you use your height for? To chase Me? women? My height? <laughs> <laughs> My height, I use it to scare people like you. <laughs> That's a good one. I feel like a dwarf in this country, man. Because what is your feet, bro? What, what's your height? 190. 190? 1.90. What, are you sure it's 1.90? Yes. Uh, the last time you checked. What about you? Me, it's uh, 170. 170. Hi, can you see? <laughs> ah, no. See, come, come, come closer. Come this, closer. This is very easy. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, no, this one, can you? This no. one, can you? No, 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 I what? can't. You can't? Yeah. Can you look for it? Yeah. It is a something. Ha! Try, let's see. Put it, put it. Ah, very far. And then jump and let's see. So when you jump, oh! <laughs> and then I, I'm going to try and jump, man. You win. Ah. It's very far, it's very far. <laughs> Not even short. I don't think you are tall, you know. You are long, man. No, no, no. You no. look so long. <laughs> you get it? How does it feel to be? tall in South Sudan as a woman? Uh, basically, being a Dinka girl and being tall, uh, hide is attached to cows or dowry, so if I am tall, that will measure the number of cows I get for my parents. So with I your height, how many cows do you think you deserve? <laughs> my parents might ask for 400 or 300. Are you kidding me? I have a sister who got married with 500. Cows? Yeah, because she's tall. She's so, taller than you? She's my height maid, and also because she's educated, so they consider education and height. You fall in love with a guy, does the guy have to be also be tall? Your specifications? It depends. If I fall in love with him, well and good. And if there is no love, then I will look for height. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this is funny, eh? Yeah. Alright, um, and what is the advantage of being tall? Uh, the advantage of being tall in, in our society, height and body is attached to leadership. And it's, it, yeah, <laughs> that's how they attach it in our cultural context. And, um, but it's also bad because you get noticed sometimes you don't want attention, you want to be yourself, but still, you, you, can, you cannot hide for your personality and you cannot hide for your height. So you mean like the more milk you drink, yeah. the more tall you become? Yeah, of course. That's not true, man. Wait, I've, been, I've been drinking milk since I no, came no, no. here, and I'm not getting tall, man. <laughs> Which wait, tell, tell me the type of milk you drink, man. So we have uh, like fresh milk of cow. Okay. Like immediately when you been milking, then so you drink you immediately without uh, boiling. 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 You know? know oh, you know, so you don't boil it, just yeah, we don't right boil. from the cow. Immediately, even while we drink then cook. Doesn't you hear that before? Yeah, yeah, I tried. I went to the cattle camp and I'm still short, man. No, you, 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 you need to be tall. 
If you could go, you use where to go to. Now, now, this guy, you never be tall again. I'll never be tall again. No way. What is the advantage of you being tall? Okay, the advantage. Yeah. Okay, the advantage of being tall, tall. Mm -hmm. is that, like, for us, if you get something up, up. it's very easy Ooh. to get. For example, we, we South Sudanese, most of us are very tall. Mm -hmm. We are now in uh, NBA. NBA? Yeah. You, do you, the height. Height. Do you yeah. play NBA? Yeah. Play do you play basketball? Basketball, yeah. You, you. Me, I'm playing basketball. Okay, right so you want to play, you want to go of and course. play NBA? Yeah, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. oh, All right, man. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, man. This heights are so intimidating, man. When it comes to South Sudan, yeah. they will, you people, you make me feel like a dwarf, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> see, he, no, but I think I'm not. He, he can't be taller than me, man. You just want me. You just want me to ah, No, no, no. no. <laughs> Bro, yes. you're so tall, man. How many feet? Seven feet three. Can you put your... What? Seven feet? Oh, seven, seven point what? Seven point three. Bro, why are you so tall, man? You're born with it. Mm, yes. That's my likeness. Mm. And how old are you now? Mm. How old are you now? I'm 20 years old, I told you. 20? Yeah. Do you think by the time you get to 30, you'll be the world tallest man? You don't, you don't think so? This is what I don't know. You've got this what you don't it. know? Yes. Man, like, I can't believe it, bro. Like, man, yeah. geez, man. raise your hand. Let me see. Man. This what? Way. Wait, this, this hold, way? It. hold it up. Hold it up. I'm going to jump and then take it. What? Oh, no way, man. <laughs> what? Jeez, man. See? Yeah. So you, 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 have, you have a girlfriend? Hmm? You have a girlfriend? Ah, uh, I don't have. You don't have? Yes. So are you looking for a girl who is taller than you or the same height? Just medium. Medium? Yes. And you carry hair? Hmm? <laughs> what day welcome to South Sudan. Thank you so, so much. So I know everyone says we're really tall here, but we are a very diverse country. We have different people from different places. So as you can see, I present to you all the heights. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> All the heights. All the heights and possibly taller. Hey, and I, I just hope that I won't be like, <laughs> you taller than me too? Yeah. She's ah, taller than you. Yes. yes. So taller than me. Yes. Even, the ladies. Even the ladies are taller than you. I'm so sorry. Man. <laughs> so you're still taller than me? Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Ah, keep no. going. <laughs> I mean, him. Keep going. Hey, ah, bro. Hey, hey, this is how we check. Come closer. No, you almost the same. Almost, almost. Hey, okay, we start. Oh my God. So like, it's full of diversity, yeah. Exactly. Different mm. heights, different colors, different languages, different 64 food. tribes, yeah. different food. But, but, but when, I, when, I, when I was coming here, I was told that South Sudan is the land of tall, dark, and then, I mean, slim. Beautiful, slim. Well, we come in all shapes and sizes. We also have fuller figures as well. We just don't happen to be here at the moment. But, <laughs> but she's a bit of a fuller figure. We have oh. all shapes, skinny, tall, fuller figures and all that. Wow. Yeah. Now I will understand that this country it's diverse, man. Yes. So South Sudanese. Yes, we're diverse. I should uh, mention uh, that. <laughs> not everybody no, is tall. See. But I'm taller. Ah, uh, no, I yes. don't think so. You know, I don't I think mean, so. Uh, I no. mean. I mean. I think you are from Ghana. Um, <laughs> Janas, mm -hmm. I mean, so many people watching us don't know who you are. Uh -huh. Who are you and what you represent? Okay, so I'm Janas. I'm a singer-songwriter based here in Juba. And I write my music in different genres, uh, jazz, hip-hop, uh, a bit of reggae, and Afro-pop lately. So I blend everything. Literally, the song playing in this background <laughs> yes. is for her. Yes. So make sure you go check out the link. Click yeah. on it, go to your YouTube channel, yeah. subscribe and support her. Yeah. What do you want to tell us about South Sudan? 
Um, it's not what you hear. You should come and see it yourself. I think Wade will tell you more. He's enjoyed himself here. South Sudan on media is not like South Sudan in South Sudan. It's a whole different thing. Why are you dying again? <laughs> I, I, I really want to go to the washroom because this smoke is really working. <laughs> Our meal cleanses your stomach as well. Keeps you clean. <laughs> <laughs>